We are now going to verify whether two matrices are inverses or not. So suppose that A equals 3, 2, 2, 1, and B equals minus 1, 2, 2, minus 3. So I am taking a 2 by 2, multiplying it two by a 2 by 2. So the result will be a 2 by 2. So I'll create my 2 by 2 right here. And the first entry is going to be the first row times the first column, because we're doing A times B here. So we get 3 times a minus 1 plus 2 times 2 minus 3 plus 4 is 1. So we get a 1 right here. Well now I'm going to do second entry is first row, second column. So that's 3 times 2 plus 2 times minus 3, which is 6 minus 6, which is 0. That's actually promising. Right now we have our reduced row echelon form coming. Now we're going to take our second row times our first column. So that's going to be 2 times a minus 1 plus 1 times 2 is minus 2 plus 2. That's also a 0. Also so far so good. And then our second row, second column, 2 times 2 plus 1 times minus 3 is 4 minus 3, which is a 1. So it turns out that A and B are inverses of each other. Or another way of writing this is that B is A inverse, or A is B inverse. Now, if they're inverses of each other, the order of multiplication doesn't matter. You'll always get the identity matrix, since they're inverses of each other.